Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Sophie and welcome back to a brand new video. Please excuse my bare face. I am not wearing makeup because I am still slightly hungover from my birthday night out and I felt like I really wanted to film this video for you but you just I'm just having one of those days where I can't be bothered to do my makeup so excuse that so as you can see from the title today's video I am going to be doing a what I got for my 21st birthday video I thought that this would be an interesting video for you guys because I know that some of you are interested so I just thought I'd do it and I thought it'd be really cool for me to kind of look back in like 10 years time and be like oh my god that's what I got for my 21st birthday so that's kind of why I do these things for your entertainment but also for mine so that I can look back on all these videos in years to come so please get your cups of teas at the ready I just want this to be kind of like a cozy video we are literally just chatting in my bedroom and I'm telling you what I got for my birthday so without further ado I'm going to jump into this video and I really hope you enjoy it So I've got loads of stuff here on the floor. I'm actually glad that I'm like going through this because I had so much stuff to open yesterday that I can't really remember everything. So I'm gonna go through it now. The first thing that I got was this Temple Spa Peace Be Still Calming Skin Balm. I love Temple Spa so much. I don't think I've really mentioned it much on my channel but I do love Temple Spa and I currently use their face oil which I might have mentioned before, but I use that like every night after I've taken my makeup off. I just love it so much. Everything smells amazing. I wondered why I couldn't smell that then and it's because the wrapper is still on there. It's just like, it's really, really like calming scents and just not like overpowering. It's so lovely. So I'm really looking forward to using that. Next things I got were some body scrub sets and also a foot pack. Now I love having things like that in my drawer because if I'm feeling like a pamper day, I will tend to get like face masks out, body scrubs out and just give myself a full pamper. So I love having these in my drawer. So this one is in goji berry and this one is in black raspberry. And then I've got a tea tree and peppermint deep moisturizing foot pack, which I think is amazing because I find around like the winter Christmas time, my skin gets very dry, like my hands, my feet, my face, and I hate it. So I love feeling moisturized and hydrated. So really happy with those two. Speaking of pamper nights, I got a Bath Fizzer gift box, which is in jasmine and amber, which sounds amazing. The wrapping is so cute. It's got like gold and pink foil around them. Reminds me a lot of Christmas, which I love. So I'm really happy with these. I love bath bombs. I get a lot of lush bath bombs as well. And I just think that these are really lovely to have in your drawer in case you want, again, a pamper night. I then got little bits and pieces for, like, manicures and pedicures, which I think, again, are really handy. I love having stuff to do my nails. Well, to be fair, I don't do my actual nails because I get acrylics, but my toenails, I paint myself and all of that. So I've got this um, manicure set here. I've then got some nail files here, a nail art dotting pens which i think are so cool you can literally do like little designs and they are pink and really really pretty and then i also got some nail varnish as well you can never have too many nail varnishes let me tell you now the next thing that i got is my favorite lipstick you guys probably have heard me rave about this and seen it in my makeup tutorials but it's the l'oreal lip paint it's matte and it's in the shade off white i love this so much i use it all the time majority of my videos if you see me wearing like a nude lipstick it's bound to be this one i just love it it lasts for so long it's so nice on the lips it's not like sticky or like you know when a matte lipstick dries and it makes your lips feel really like sore it doesn't do that and i just really really love it i then got a mac lip liner i've said this on my channel before i love this lip liner so much it's in the shade stripped down 
I think it's, is it stripped down or stripped down? I think it's stripped down. Let me have a look. Okay, so it's in the shade Strip Down. I love this lip liner so much because it feels lovely on the lips. It's such a lovely colour as well. And paired with the lipstick that I just showed you, I think is amazing. I love that look so, so much. I then got a pair of House of Lashes Iconic Light Lashes. I got bought these from falseeyelashes.co.uk. I love the company so much. They do so, so many pairs of eyelashes on there and they're all so affordable. They're really fast delivery. I just love them so much. So I got bought a pair of lashes that they stock on their site and they are gorgeous. Now for all of you that don't know, I literally have so, so many pairs of eyelashes. I basically collect them. It's just one of my guilty pleasures. Every time I see a pair of eyelashes that I love, I have to pick them up. I think these were around £15 though, so they were on the more expensive side of the eyelashes. But I just, I couldn't resist. I had to put it on my birthday list. Now the next item that I got bought, you might have seen in some of my Instagram photos. Um because I have had it for a while, I think I've had it for about a month now, it was an early birthday present and it was bought by Callum. I really wanted this bag and it was on offer at the time that he bought it for me because I saw it and I was like, I just, I just gotta have it. So he went out and bought it for me when I got my new job, just as kind of like a little treat. So I got this early, but it is my favourite bag. So it's a DKMY bag, just brown, and it's got DKMY all over. And then it's got a gold strap, and you can also shorten this as well. So it can be like that. But I normally wear it with like the long strap. And I just love this bag so, so much. It's just stunning, and it goes with any outfit as well. Now at the moment I have a massive obsession with perfumes, I don't know what it is, I have always kind of loved perfumes but I've never been into like the really expensive ones and it's only recently that I've kind of got into perfumes and I've been going into the shops and smelling the ones that I like and it kind of just so happens that the ones I like are the most expensive ones. So I put two perfumes on my birthday list because these are the ones that I love the most. I have never had one of these perfumes before but the other one I have and you guys I think I've mentioned it to you before. So the first one that I got bought is the Miss Dior perfume. I love this perfume so so much. It smells absolutely amazing. I can't even explain how much I love this perfume. <laughs> Like, I, I think it's a little bit of a weird obsession. So, I always get complimented when I wear this perfume. The packaging is amazing, like the actual bottle I love. And every time I smell it, I'm like, mm. so really happy with that. And then the next perfume that I got bought is the Giorgio Armani C perfume. This is the Fiori one, Fiori? It's spelled F-I-O-R-I. Fiori, and I think it's fairly new and I first smelt this in duty free on the way back from Greece and I'd already bought my Miss Dior perfume so I was like I cannot buy another perfume and I wanted it in 100ml. A 100ml bottle is about £100 which I've never spent that much money on a perfume before so I put it on my birthday list and bless Callum he bought it for me. I can easily say that this perfume is my ultimate favourite perfume. It smells absolutely incredible. Every time I smell it, I just, it just does something to me, all right? So if you haven't smelt this perfume, go down to your local boots and smell it. I just, I can't, I can't. I'm so happy with this present and Again, the packaging is amazing. I just think it's so elegant. The only issue with the bottle is that it isn't clear, so you can't see how much you've actually used. But you know, it's okay because the smell is so worth it. I just, oh, just, just don't, just don't. Moving on, because I actually think I could marry this perfume. And then I got bought by my sister a new microphone. So 
fingers crossed guys the audio on my videos are going to be so much better i mean it's not terrible now but anything to better my videos i will do so i put this on my list and it's the snowball ice black microphone so i thought i'd give this a go i do want to try at some point asmr not because i want to be an asmr channel i just think it would be so funny to try and like do it and to see me do it so i really want to try doing that I'm pretty sure you can do that with this microphone. So let me know in the comments down below if you would love to see an ASMR video because I would be more than happy to do that for you. I'm really, really happy with this. It actually was like a big surprise because I put this on my birthday list. Every year when it's anyone's birthday, we always make a list and send it to everyone and they'll just pick off of it what they want to buy us. I thought my sister was going to buy me makeup because that's what I just told her to get because we weren't really sure. And she picked this off my list without me knowing. So really happy with this and I can't wait to try it. Next thing I got was actually this cold that I'm wearing now. This is from Missy Empire. And I've always seen this on like Instagram and just like photos on like Pinterest. And I've thought I love that so much. And like on Missy Empire's promotions and I just, I just had to get it. So this is just a loungewear set. This is the top here and you can tie it into a bow and then you've just got the trousers at the bottom. I love this so much, it's so comfortable. I wore it yesterday when I went out for my birthday and I just love it. It's so worth it. I just love that it's grey because you know guys I love grey and I'm really really happy with it. I can just lounge around the house with my fluffy grey slippers just like a grey queen. And something else that is surprise surprise grey is this jumper that Callum bought me. This is from Pretty Little Thing. It's just like something to lounge around in and like chill out. If you guys follow me on Instagram then you would have seen that when I went to the airport to go to Ibiza I was wearing a nude version of this and I loved it so much that I put a grey one on my list as well. If you don't follow me on Instagram, I'll just put it down below. It's just underscore Sophie Faye underscore. So if you want to keep up with any of my outfits or anything that I'm doing, then feel free to go over and follow. Yeah, that jumper is about, I think it's £18 and it's so comfortable. Like it's jersey material. It is perfect for winter and for lounging around or going to the airport if you're going on holiday still. So I'll definitely recommend getting one of those because I've got two colours now and I would love to get some more of them. And then I was bought a pair of heels, but they didn't fit, which I'm really sad about. I tried them on the day before my birthday because I was gonna wear them out on my birthday. And my mum was really worried that they wouldn't fit, which she was right. So I tried them on, they didn't fit which I'm really, really sad about because they are gorgeous. They are just a nude pair of heels with a clear block heel, which is amazing, but it just didn't fit. And then I got quite a lot of money off of relatives, which has been spent on shopping <laughs> or has been put into my savings. So, you know, all of the grown up stuff. I am 21 now, so need to <laughs> need to think about these things and I am moving out next year. So a lot of the money has been put into savings and been put to good use instead of blowing it like I would normally do. <laughs> and then the last thing that I got bought was something from Callum, which I'm not going to tell you about yet because I am going to be doing a video on it in a few weeks time. Just keep your eyes out for mid-October. It was quite an expensive thing and I've never done it before. So I'm really scared. I'm really scared, but I'm really excited as well. And I'm really excited to do the video for you because I think some of you would find it interesting. And yeah, I'm not gonna give too much away yet, but just keep your eyes peeled for the middle of October and then I think you will know what I'm talking about because you'll see the video. So that is the end of this video guys. I really hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, please do not forget to click the like button and also subscribe to my channel if you are new. If you are new here, welcome. My name's Sophie and I post videos every Wednesday and Sunday and I would love it if you subscribed to become part of this YouTube family. I really hope you guys have had an amazing week so far and I will see you in the next video Sunday at five. Bye.